Uh, welcome, amazing ballroom dancers. My name is Noe Alonso, and I'm your dance professor here on YouTube. Today, we're going to be covering a little bit of Viennese waltz. In the last episode, I covered uh, what Viennese waltz is. Um, that way, you understand like what you're kind of getting into. Viennese waltz is an advanced level social dance, kind of like Argentine tango, salsa, and West Coast swing. Sometimes these dances are just a little bit difficult just to start off. They're not as easy to pick up. Um, the thing that makes this dance a little bit more difficult is that it's a faster dance. However, the easy part about this dance is that the, the moveset is relatively schmore, um, as, in as in things related to close position. So we're going to be focusing on those, but we also will be adding in a little bit of open work. So in American Style Smooth, Smooth allows us to break frame, to not be in a closed hold. Well, what's going to be happening is that we're going to have a couple of movements that are going to be opening out so that we have an ability to play around with our arms, our leg, whatever, um, so that we get a, a firm understanding of what smooth dancing can be like. Okay, so Viennese Waltz. Viennese Waltz is one of those types of dances that is faster to start off. So the easiest way to think about this is that your box is the exact same. So if you haven't seen the Waltz video in my, uh, in my, uh, uh, smooth series, please go over that so you have a better frame of reference for what's going on. If not, I'll be covering it from, from bottom to top in this video, okay? So, first step is your box. Okay, cool. Your box. Ready to box. What's going to happen is that you have a forward, side chain quick, back, side chain quick, forward, side chain quick, back, side chain quick. Now, what happens is that for this particular dance, you're going to want to learn how to travel relatively quickly because this style of dancing is exactly like how you see in those old Disney movies. Like in Beauty and the Beast, when there's like a million people going around, in Anastasia, when the entire royal family was dancing around and around, they were dancing a baby's waltz. So that's the style of dancing which we're going to be covering. What I'm going to learn first is your progressive. So you have a forward side chain quick, back side chain quick. One, two, three, two, two, three. Now what happens is that it does speed up. So for those of us as uh, that are taking the role of Paul, it's going to be back, two, three, one, two, three, two, two, three, two, three. Then we have the next thing. Okay? So imagine that your steps are smaller. But when it when uh, when applicable and when you can, you want to make it. You want to travel it almost like you would in waltz. So you do want to have a lot of one, two, three, one, two, three. It is supposed to travel quite a bit, and you are supposed to put a lot of rev into it. Press the box. One, two, three, two, two, three. Now what I'm going to have us do. Start off. So we can start already working on a bigger, uh, a bigger amalgamation. Is that we're gonna start off with one, two, three, two, two, three. One, two, three, curve, two, three. Now what's gonna happen is from that curve, I've changed about nine degrees. So the last one that I just did, starting off my right foot as a lead, was step two, three. Now I'm gonna go back, two, three, back, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, curve on the right side. So when you have the inside edge, it's kind of easier to, just, to turn with that like that's closest to the inside, okay? Or at least that's how I think about it. Um, really, just curve it generally. So you're gonna have first starting off with a progressive box. One, two, 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 three, two, curve, two. One, two, 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 three, two, curve, two. One, two, 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 Box one, two, progressive. Continue progressive. One, two. Okay, easy piece. Same deal with the follow. One, two, three, two, two, three, two, three, four, two. One, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three, one, two, two, two. Three, four, then back. Two, take six, one. One, one, one. And then continue from there. Okay? 
Now, the thing about the Viennese Waltz is that since there is a lot of momentum happening, we can't just shift a solid side. Even though I just did that for a pattern, this is for the sake of understanding that there is a similarity in between uh, regular waltz and Viennese waltz in American style. With Viennese waltz, we have a little bit of a leading of one side, then the leading of another. So your steps are going to be going forward, forward and slide to the side, change weight, forward, forward and slide to the side. So what's going to be happening is that you're going to make this type of pattern going on when you're going from the basic. So you're going from straight to slightly curved, and then that's going to be the shape in which you're uh, making with your feet. So if I did this in this direction, we have one, two, three, two, two, three. Let's see how I'm leading with one side, and then as soon as I take my step, I'm leading with another side. Heavy side. Uh -huh. So you have those. Uh, those uh, sides leading as you are going, as you're progressing. Now the same thing is gonna be happening in reverse. So as we're going from back, let's say, one, two, three, two, three, three, two, three. That in itself is a distinctive difference in between the styles of dance. So when you dance this, as lead, you're gonna be going again. One, leading side, right, left side leads, Left, right side leads, right, left side leads before I go into my next step. Okay? Now that's for the progressive step. It doesn't happen for every single step, but this is something that helps out in traveling through the floor. Okay? So hopefully this, this step helps you guys in uh, understanding the dance. So if you guys liked anything from today, please hit the like, share, and I will see you guys in the next video.